Hey, what's up? T-R-O-Y, the maker, checking in. Welcome to project number 14. In this project, we're gonna make a wall clock. So I know a lot of you have heard the news about Nipsey Hussle and his death. I became a fan of Nipsey Hussle when I first heard that Crenshaw mixtape. I knew I wanted to do something with this project that had something to do with Nipsey Hussle. I didn't know what I wanted to do, so I was trying to come up with some ideas and all that, and I came across this quote. And the quote says, on a mission, your worst enemy is idle time. I seen that quote, I said, I know what I'm gonna make. A wall clock. I'm gonna show you the design and how I came up with the idea. And so here we go. Here's the uh, design that I came up with. Got his face right here. Here's the quote that I was saying on a mission. Your worst enemy is idle time. As you can see, I just put a lot of stuff that kind of relates to Nipsey. Or I have the All Money In logo. You see the Crenshaw. He always was rep repping the Crenshaw. He always was at the Lakers game. It's gonna be a circle clock. And as you can see in the middle, that's the little cutout where I'm gonna put the hands through. So let's head over to the laser and cut it out. Right, there you have it all cut out all engraved as you can see this was my first time doing an actual photo this part up here kind of got engraved also I'm gonna have to try the photos again but overall it came out really really good I use clear acrylic I did a black acrylic also that I'm gonna put behind it you know so it'll stand out really really nice but yeah that's gonna be the wall clock it came out really good let's do some b-roll There you have it, man. Project number 14 complete. Laser cut wall clock, man. Inspired by Nipsey Hussle, man. Rest in peace. If you like this video, hit that thumbs up. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe and the bell. And I'll see you guys at the next project. You're not blinging and having all kind of crazy diamonds and all that. I guess you're here to get your money right, huh? All the time, man. You know, all that is cool for the image and all that. But all them is liabilities, you feel me? I'd rather invest in some real estate, you know what I'm saying? Oh, wait, well, can you repeat that again, man? You're up and coming artist. What did you say you want to do? I said invest in some assets as opposed to trick off my money on some liabilities like diamonds. You know what I'm saying? Cars that lose value so you can drive them off the lot. So you you're trying to you're trying to get land. Exactly, homie. A real asset. Take care of my peoples, cause you know that's that it, it look good, but at the end of the day, you losing value, homie. It ain't it ain't it ain't appreciating, it's depreciating. It's losing value. What do you think uh why do you think it's so hard for people to get that message? You know, I mean, one and a half, you get guys that say they got to impress the females. Female ain't trying to talk to you unless you blinged out. On the other hand, you got other people feel like they got to show off to the homies and impress them with their riches. I mean, what, what do you think is the, how do we get that out of that mindset? I mean, I feel like that's insecurity. Material things ain't nothing. You feel me? At the end of the day, it's who you is. 